By swapping the inside for the outside, Columbia might just be onto something. Stay tuned for my review of the OutDry Extreme Platinum Tech Shell Jacket. The size I'm wearing is a men's small, and as you can see, it's pretty much the perfect size for me. As with a lot of the Columbia products, I find that it does fit a little bit large maybe, but that's because I consider this more of a lifestyle, everyday piece, rather than athletic, uh, racing kind of apparel. For starters, let's have a look at the pockets. It features four generous pockets, two in the top for your chest stash pockets, and two main pockets on the side. Now I've got to say, these are huge pockets. During the trip to Iceland, we spent a lot of time in the rain, and I had my big DSLR light camera with me. I was actually able to fit the camera within the pocket, and when I zipped it up, I was really happy to find out that it was pretty much waterproof. The zippers that they use in their pocket are what they call their light rail design. As you can see, each of them has their own pull tab, which is easy to grasp with either gloves or mittens. On the inside of each pocket is mesh, so if you're looking for ventilation, that's one quick way to get ventilation. Just open a couple pockets. But, if you want some real ventilation, Check out the pit zips under here. They're pretty long and they've got a zipper at both the top and the bottom. So you can either open it a bit from the top or from the bottom. As far as the sleeves go, at first I was a little disappointed because I thought, ah, oh, it's too long. But in reality, this is very handy because when the rain was really coming down, I would just pull the sleeve down over my hand and still keep warm and dry. In terms of the hood, it's like pretty much any good hood these days. There's a fair bit of volume in there you can actually fit any hat or even a small helmet. It also features a couple of uh, adjustment points on the inside here, and that'll tighten it around your side as well as around the back. Now finally, if you have a look at the main zipper, it's a very beefy YKK zipper, which goes up and down pretty cleanly. And you can see behind there, I've got a bit of a rubber flap, which helps keep that waterproof integrity. Last but not least, another great little feature. At the bottom, you'll notice it's a two-way zipper. So if I need to, I can actually unzip from the bottom in order to have access to pockets or whatever underneath. The standout feature of this jacket is the OutDry Extreme membrane. Having that soft shell on the inside keeps it very nice against your skin, even if you're wearing short sleeves. It never gets clammy, even when you're sweating. It also helps promote that moisture from going from your skin, absorbed through the fabric, and then straight out through the membrane. In the two months I've had this jacket testing it, it's performed really well. I've had it out on whale watching expeditions on the water, as well as took it all the way to Iceland where we experienced quite a bit of extreme weather, including pouring rain, hard winds, and even a trip behind some waterfalls. When I matched this up with a light down jacket underneath, it was the ideal solution for keeping warm without a whole lot of weight. Also, if I just wanted a jacket to cut the wind, this thing was perfect, as it's lightweight and with the venting I can stay cool, but keep all that wind chill away from me. All in all, I've been very happy with this jacket. At first, I wasn't sure I'd be a big fan, given the unique styling and different approach they've taken. However, more often than not, this is the jacket I'm now reaching for in my closet when the weather looks iffy. I hope it stands the test of time because I don't want to be taking it off anytime soon. Well, that does it for my review of the Columbia OutDry Extreme Platinum Tech Shell Jacket. For more information on this and all the products, head to Columbia.com.